Hey there XLs, back again with an update video for my Tornado Shot Deadeye. Since the last update I have uh, found my helmet, I am no longer headless, and I've leveled up a few times, I'm almost level 98. I've been doing uh, Legion Beaches, I got tired of Crimson Temple, felt like switching it up, um, so I've been doing Legion Beaches with Harbinger and Essence and Strongbox. It's not the, the most profitable strategy, but I've definitely been turning a profit while I've been doing this. So I did uh, just about three levels worth of blasting. Uh, let me just run a quick map and show you some of the improvements I made to the character. So I have invested probably another 20 or 30 divs into this guy. Um, Progenesis really doesn't count. I just had some liquid currency and I wanted to buy something and I died a little while ago. So I just got mad. So I bought this. Um, but the biggest of this, I got another Makongo tattoo. Inspired Learning's not that big of a buy. Um, it's just like these, uh, are, are a Hongui warmonger shatter things work even with Secrets of Suffering because it says as though frozen without actually freezing. So that's kind of cool, but it, it doesn't really do much. But let's just run, uh, run a quick map here. So it's a tornado shot dead air. There's not too much to talk about, but this is it's kind of been my first time doing legions in uh, a few leagues, if not a few years, and you know, especially as tornado shot with nine projectiles, you can really see why you know why is it's such a popular farming strategy. I think I might actually drop harbies. They take so long, but I've gotten maybe two fracturing orbs out of the entire time. I've had them out, so it's like, eh, I mean, it's kind of worth it. I basically just use them to generate bubblegum currency to keep funding the Legion map device thing. I didn't juice this map at all, so it's super empty, but I mean, so it's a tornado shot, dead eye. There's not too much to talk about here. Yeah, with uh, nine projectiles and three chains, it's just a clearing machine. And blisters. There we go. So let's, see, let's go over some of the improvements I made. Um, I crafted this quiver, uh, just spamming dread essences on the fractured base. I could still slam this or maybe craft life or something instead, but I'm getting by just fine with 3,500 HP. So this works for now. That's a big improvement. I believe it puts me just over, yeah, 252% projectile speed. So it feels really good. Still using this amulet and this ring that I crafted. Um, I made this helm, got the base pretty cheap. Very, uh, very basic, but the secondary projectile makes a really big difference. Let's see, I swapped over to Hyres. I don't think I was using this in the last video. Um, but this is it's just, you know, gives me more flat damage, helps me cap suppression, and uh, it's a huge chunk of evade, so that's nice. Let's see, I, I was using that Assassin's Bow, but I switched over to an Ivory just for uh, extra crit. Um... I'm going to be working on improving this. I think down the line, I'm either going to... Well, I actually did buy a base with plus one arrow, but I realized I kind of hate crafting bows, so I'll probably just buy a better one. Um, Probably sell this and buy a better one. But, yeah, overall, still the nine rage per second, so my Berserk has full uptime. The Tornado Shot Ballistas are an insane amount of damage. Um... I think like you can get away with doing just one tornado shot setup, but you either need to be doing um, like ruse volatility setup or just have like a really really good bow. But overall, um, I really like this character. It's just fun to map, fun to blast. Beach is a is a nice map that drops good cards. I got a let's see sixteen fortunate cards so far. Not the best. Um, but yeah, this is fun. Probably keep gonna keep playing this for a while. Stack up some cash, saving and fund the new build. I'm not sure if I want to go Pathfinder or maybe respect my um, 
Inquisitor to something cast on crit. I don't know. It's like I've I managed to make three. I mean, not complete, but you know, three builds in very good shapes with very high investment that kind of do each thing they were designed for very well. So I mean, I don't know, I'm kind of hesitant to take apart those characters. Maybe I'll just make another one. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, I just wanted to make an update video, show everyone how the build is going. And yeah, thanks for tuning in. See everybody next time.